Thank you for tuning in to the Pointless Talks podcast. This episode is being brought to you as a part of the many things that Pointless creates. For our returning listeners, thank you so much for coming back. And if this is your first episode, welcome, get comfortable, and please keep an open mind. All right. Welcome back. Hello. Hi. Hi. Greetings, greetings, greetings. What is this, Wednesday? Happy hump day or whatever. Yeah, it is Wednesday. <laughs> it is Wednesday. I apologize, folks. It was not pointless. It was me, my fault. <laughs> Accountability. Had a little, had a little, <laughs> little plans. Y'all going to be all right, though. You Facts. feel me? Okay. Um, all right. So mm-mm. this past <laughs> week has been like. Just, you ain't hear me say mm-mm. Just a mm-mm. shit show. Like, what the f- fuck i don't mean to come on the episode just cussing like this but i'm tired of shit bruh like what what (sighs) i don't even know where to start like basically like okay so i have a good day a little week i actually have four but i'm spreading it out over the next couple the next month i guess i'm gonna start with that because that was a shit show also that is what led me to the good day of the week so what exactly um, you know, fast fashion folks stealing black creatives um merchandise and selling Wait, what it. Have, as I don't even know nothing about that stuff. What's going on? Okay. So there's this swimwear line um called House of Gem. Mm-hmm. Um I don't know the girl's what kind name. Of clothes they do? Swimwear. Just swimwear. Oh, Some you did nice say it. So bathing swimwear? suits too. Yeah, like why? And they do custom pieces and whatever. The mm-hmm. young lady is from St. Lucia, right? Okay. She lives in St. Lucia. Pieces mm-hmm. are beautiful. I got to send you her Instagram, but if y'all are listening, yeah, um, actually, piece. I don't know if she has Instagram. Me can I wear? For your Oman uh, child. Send that, send that go gear. Come on, no women are doing it. You might see one where you're like, you might want to see her in a bikini. Oh, I'm like, me, I might want to buy her one bikini. Summertime, I come. Bad man don't wear a bikini. No kind you of, know? Mm, none of them something there. <laughs> but um, her Instagram is House of Gem. Gem is spelled with a J underscore everything. H-O-U-S-E-O-F-J-E-M underscore. That is the page for the swimmer line. So, okay. You know, I'm on Instagram, minding my little business. Not Instagram. I keep saying Instagram. Somebody on Instagram talking about me. I'm on Twitter, <laughs> minding my little business. And I see um, this post, and I'm like, it's two bathing suits that look pretty much identical. And uh, let me see if I can find the post, um, the original post. Because I was like... So what is it? Somebody T for something our style? Yeah, or, shine, she in, whatever, T for design. But they T for everybody design. Exactly. She in is like the melting pot for the cheap for the world, bro. Yeah, and then I sell it for fifteen dollar. That burned me. And how much was she selling hers for? Probably like a hundred or something Snoozy. like that. But <laughs> also when you I zoomed in because you know I'm a detail person. I zoomed in on her design. And it's a nice ribbed bathing suit with like the straps look all ropey. The one I'm about to show you, the one on Shein is very cheaply made, and you can That's tell up. because That's look at um, can you see it? That's the bathing yeah, suit from Shein. I can see it. It's cute, right? And then hers. Me Watch me in. not be able to see the damn difference. Oh, oh god. god! Oh god! <laughs> I'm trying, and I'm Bro. here like, let me zoom yeah. in so you can see. And then that's hers. See, I gotta the send loop, you the I pictures. Mean, the little I gotta send a little you. Different. You're funny. Here's <laughs> my issue. Here's my thing with that though, because I, mm-hmm. I do hate that people get their stuff taken and shit like mm-hmm. that, right? But you remember when? Not even remember. People still do bootleg movie. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> they still do pirating. Oh, mm-hmm. okay. So you would have to pay what twenty something dollars to go in to see this movie, right? Mm-hmm. But a bootleg nigga on the corner can give you that $5. shit for five dollars, and, and you, you and the whole family can watch it in the video. Yes, and I talk to the video, and right. something might shift, somebody exactly. might cough. <laughs> exactly, it might dip if security coming through. <laughs> yeah. You get what I'm it saying? It get dark at one point because they got to put it in the bag. <laughs> But unfortunately, sister, like that is it. That is the world. Like you put something out and people gonna grab it up. But she and though they be grabbing everybody's everything. Mm. So um, is there something she could do? She gonna sue or I mean technically no, because she didn't get it patented. patent. I just want to she, she didn't get a patent. To... It's kind of just like that, just that one bathing suit, or there was many. That's the only one that I see so far. But she has a she has a bunch suit. of designs though. Her designs are not. Nice. But like, they just took that little white one, that plain one. 
that's the one that they what you call it but is that her she hand makes all of hers huh was that her bestseller I don't know if that's her bestseller or not, but them T far something. No, I know that it is, and that's terrible. It's a terrible mm-hmm. thing, also. But I know what kind of times we in, and I know that uh-huh. people don't give a damn, and these mm-hmm. companies don't care. They don't. You feel what I'm saying? So that's why I'm just like, <sighs> and it's, yeah, but it's kind of plain too. It's just she didn't patent well, it, so she makes she hand makes them. Yes. Oh girl, she that hand makes hers. Sucks, that's what I'm saying. I sent you the free. post so you can oh, see. No. I sent you the post so you can see the difference. Hopefully, better than me trying to show you on the computer screen. Hopefully, you can see <laughs> the difference. I, I guarantee you, episode I can see what the hell she's talking. Oh no, where are you sent this at? To your WhatsApp, yeah. I think. Let me see this. Okay, so who's the first one? Oh, it's side she, by side on this. Mm-hmm. This weekend. All right, let's take a look, people. Let's see what she's trying to show me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, poor thing. This her tweeting? Yeah, that's her tweet. Oh, baby. Mm-hmm. Let me see this. Okay, so this... Oh, this, <laughs> this is the Shein version. Yeah. Plain. Okay, where's hers? Just next to it. The one in, with the black model. You see... I'm about to say, show a good girl, see if she can't see a difference, because... Um, not but <laughs> sweetheart okay so you want me to show the lady to see what she's saying yeah, yes the woman lady. in the room <laughs> i have something for you to see all right city um she ain't one here for the 15 dollar <laughs> right all right and um sifi mama one here right okay <laughs> Because I know what you're thinking, exactly what you're thinking is what you're thinking. And I don't even want you to do that. I can't stand y'all. Um, but maybe it's a picture taking too of it because they they ain't play with this little picture on Shein. Okay? Mm-hmm. And I think the way it looks, the material, right? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Poor thing. It looks nice though. I, I see she's great. Mm-hmm. I like it. Uh damn. <laughs> Damn, so she's and it's not patent, so there's nothing she can do. She better go get that thing. She better get that shit together. Yeah. But that's so hard. One a like, white a white bathing suit. See, my thing with it though, as a as a visual person, mm-hmm. I could definitely see the difference because one, they definitely use a cheap ass fast fashion zipper on the Shein one. Mm-hmm. Like everything about it is fast fashion. Like it's probably like that typical thin ass bathing suit material um, versus it's the same exact design though. It's the same exact design. Even you can see like down to where the stitching in it. I'm like, yo, they like, that's wild. Yeah, I'm but yeah, the ribbed look is probably yeah, thicker, nicer me. material, all that you like great the stuff. Ribbed look better. I'm not saying I like it better. I'm just seeing the difference. I'm just saying that looks like a more quality material. Girl, versus what's it called, one, honey? But for a one wear and go, you know these girls gonna jump on the shit. Uh, oh yes, the a quick, a quick little. I'm going to okay, Miami I'm for the weekend. The, okay, I gotta to go to the beach. I need to just get me a little fifteen dollar yeah. pop up real quick. Uh huh. Hundred dollars is, is, but she makes them herself. Yeah, hand so makes them, and that she is. does do custom. So I guess if you see one that you like and you don't like how your body would look in it, she'll custom make it for you and yeah. whatever, no help whatever. For the little man, man. She ships she international. Of, like sealed up and locked up mm-hmm. so can do her thing but that sucks though. sorry mama sorry to hear yeah but. that shit whatever but she's still you know just for the creative aspect and i'm looking at the other bathing that's not the only one she has the other bathing suits that she has i'm like i need to lose this belly oh jesus i, I need to lose this belly because i'm looking at one of the videos now and i'm like i need to lose this belly like I don't want the bathing suit to fit but the body. Want I want the though. body been, to fit the body. You've been out. You've been Child, working out. I didn't work out since we last recorded. Let me. <laughs> Why? Well, wait, so last week? <laughs> that ain't that bad. You make it seem like it was a month or so. I mean, it like, might I mean, be at this you point. Just take a week. Sometimes you take a week off sometimes. That'd be my problem. I take the week off and it run into the next week. And nah, then man, now we here. Allow yourself grace, though, to take a week Speaking off and just breathe of... and just get in, and then get your ass back in. Yeah, I did a um, <laughs> I did an aura reading over the weekend, and an aura <laughs> like Harry Potter. 
aura, not aura. Aura. Listen, <laughs> you didn't say that right to me. You said an aura, like your aura. I get yes, that. I thought you said an aura. aura. I thought it was like a Harry Potter joke. No, Ooh. no, no. Anyway, that, so, that is so fitting because I actually had on a Harry Potter shirt when I did it. <laughs> For those that know, they know. Muggles. Exactly. <laughs> Ew. Mm. Go ahead. <laughs> but my friend Heather um, was Heather. telling me. Who is Heather? Who is Heather? She actually. Uh, Where did that come from? It's my friend from high school. Oh, first time I hear them name them as a Heda. <laughs> She's Cuban, but um, oh, she was telling me. <laughs> she was telling me um that they have because not everybody knows that I left Florida. So she was telling me that they have Thanks, like too. an aura photography um <laughs> aura photography thing coming up in um, Pembroke Pines, and oh. I was like, girl, I don't live in Florida no more. She was yeah. like, what? Yikes. and um just like oh my god so like literally that same weekend no not even the weekend like the next day i think i'm on instagram and a post comes up for like the um metaphysical store that we went to with like all the stones and everything mm -hmm. and they were actually doing aura photography readings and i was mm -hmm. like oh shit so i sent it to her she was like bitch our magic is lining up you have to go and i was like okay. <laughs> so I was like, all right, fine, fuck it. So I went. Now, you know how I am about, like, readings and stuff like that. Like, I've never gotten a reading. I've gotten one reading ever in my life outside of myself. Like, I pull my own cards and, like, you know, I'll look at the Zodiac shit, but nothing that was centered around, like, someone being in my presence and, like, whatever. Mm -hmm. So I was, like, very apprehensive about it. And she was like, Janae, it's not, like, about your life. It's, like, just, you know, what you exude. Like, it's just about, like, your essence, essentially. And I was just like, all right, fine. I can wrap my mind around that. Mm -hmm. So I get there. And I'm, like, second guess. I'm like, oh, shit. Because it was a last-minute pop-up. Like, I had to um, do something. I ended up in the neighborhood. And I was like, oh, shit. While I'm over here, I might as well do it. And I was like, mm -hmm. fuck. I'm wearing this Harry Potter shirt. Like, that's so, like, eh, Like, I don't know. Whatever. So... I get in there and everybody's like, oh my God, hey, welcome. And I was just like, hey. It was a, then, what was it like? Like you walking in like a whole bunch of people and shit? No, it wasn't a bunch of people. It was in the store itself. It, it was the bigger store. Because remember we had went to the two stores? Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. it was the bigger one. So I'm like, are you here for the aura? And I was like, yes. Yeah. So she's like, okay, you can wait. There's someone in there now, whatever. I'm like, all right, cool. Was it in a side room? Yeah, it's one of the side the rooms. No, not that room. It was an actual secluded room that was just like set oh. up for just that. It was like a little empty room. Okay. Yeah. So... I get in there and she was like, oh my gosh, I love your hair. I love the way it's bouncing and flowing and just swaying oh, with your movements. And I was oh, like, girl, don't sweep me up. What's listen, the right? Oh, and I was like, don't. thank you. <laughs> she was a sense that I was just like, bitch, what the fuck I'm in here doing? Yeah. So, <laughs> so I look and this shit looked like, it looked like shock therapy or some shit. I don't know. There was like two little machines on the table with like oh, handprints. Like it was oh, like metal man. finger things. And I'm like, oh, man. what the fuck is this? <laughs> and like you're sitting down and then there's like a as a photographer i did like all mediums of photography when i was in college mm -hmm. so like i'm like this is a large format photography camera mm -hmm. like it's a what you call it it's just polaroid mm -hmm. but like on it i'm reading it and it says like you know oral photography da, 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 da. so like you place your hands on the metal thing so that all your fingers are covering the silver parts in your palm or whatever and you mm -hmm. look into the camera and you're supposed to be real chill and like whatever whatever you're feeling and it takes a picture and it's a polaroid and it just captures like what oh let me show you the picture damn i gotta go get it i think i took a picture of it on my phone so i could show you okay. and i was just like Okay, but funny thing, the first time they took the picture, fucking camera drop. Oh no, ma'am. Look at mine. Shit, oh my god. It? That's the same thing she said. So oh yeah. my god. <laughs> so the f actually, let me show you what the first picture looks like because they caught it like it was in the middle of developing. So it's still kind of like yeah. So <laughs> you have a big ass red fro. Exactly. So. <laughs> Oh, That's child. What, that mean? what the hell does that mean? Yeah, we'll get to that. So, um, <laughs> so the second picture comes out, and she's just like, "Oh my gosh, your aura is so bright! Like it's so full." And da da da. And I was just like, "Okay, what the fuck does that mean?" Girl, that mean? <laughs> and she's like, like, "She's like, I don't know if I've seen any today that's been this full. It basically means that I'm taking care of my energy and I'm feeding myself in the ways that I need to spiritually and blah blah blah. That's okay. why it like takes up the whole picture." And I was okay. like, "Okay, yeah, I can get with that. Okay, 
okay right. <laughs> and then she was like the color it was more like a um deep orange or whatever like a deep reddish orange what do you call it like auburn yeah something so mm-hmm. and then she was like you know that basically just represents like you know your sacral energy which tripped okay. me out because i was just <laughs> Heather be giving me tips and tricks on my tarot and my energies and all this shit. Like that's, Mm -hmm. that's my nigga. But Mm -hmm. she, um, we had just finished talking about me like tapping into like my sacral energy and making sure like I'm feeding that and how I need to like, you know, get my shit together or whatever. And so she said that and I was just like, girl, what? (laughs) Okay. Mm -hmm. So she talked more about that. And then, um, she was saying that I don't know if you see like there's like a little gap in the top right there where the colors separate a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I see that. Actually, before let me I talk about that part. Let me talk about the the indigo at the top. Apparently, right. the presence of that dark, like v- very vibrant indigo is basically intuition, spirituality, mm. being able to tap into your clairvoyance. Okay. So she stops and she says to me, "She's like, do you put that stuff to the back of your mind?" Hell I'm no, sitting there ma'am. like, hell no. Nah. Excuse no, me, ma'am. what? <laughs> no, ma'am. Excuse me, what? <laughs> she was like, yeah. She's like, um, most people, if they're not fully tapped into like their spirituality and like stuff like that, you know, you might have premonitions here or there. You might be like, oh, that's just deja vu or oh, that's a coincidence. Uh, and you know, you oof. might say things that come to life. You might be, oh, um, you might be. What she said? She said prophesizing. That's um, the one. She said a bunch of words that I was just like, no, bitch, no. <laughs> I wonder what the hell mine looks like. Listen, and she was like, you know. It's just indigo like hell, then. Dog. <laughs> and then she was like, you know, she was like, basically, you have the power. You just have to, like, feed Tap into in, it. That, huh? She's like, the reason that it's mm-hmm. so far away is because you're kind of pushing it to the Either side. Way. Like, you know, she's like, but mm-hmm. the fact that yours is so bright. Mm-hmm. She's like, you. She basically was just like, bitch, you have the power. And I was just mm-hmm. like. Oh my god, I'm a witch. <laughs> <laughs> you've been wanting to hear this since uh, you've been wanting to hear this Listen, for a while. I'm waiting for my letter from Hogwarts, okay? Get so out of here. <laughs> no friend. <laughs> so um she was saying though that opening at the top between the two represents that like the portal is open. <laughs> oh, shit. Listen. If I have any questions for my ancestors and my spirit guides, Ooh. now is the time to ask these questions. Ooh. If I need clarity about anything, now is the time to ask. And it doesn't have to be any like mantra or chant or anything weird. Just I can literally just write talk. it down. Mm. And like, you know, if I want to journal it or whatever. And I was just sitting there like. Wild times. WTF. WTF? I mean, it don't sound too, it don't sound too witchy, witchy. Yeah. Crazy. Like it, you know, I can't get yeah. too much because my words are not <laughs> listen. You ain't gonna be feeling all that. Exactly. But, I, mean, I was just like, girl, what? I it, girl, I'm just be so scared. Oh my god, what it look like? Nothing. It's just listen. Like, like, she was asking ignored. me, she's like, What do you think yours would look like? And I was like, I don't know. I like the color blue. I hope maybe that's cool. <laughs> like okay. I don't well, you, I mean, you had a touch, but yeah. You had my color. Oh boy. listen. And then she was saying that um the there's also like a little bit of color by my throat. So she's like, you know, you need to open up your throat, throat chakra. chakra. If you need to speak up mm-hmm. for yourself and if there are things ah, that you want to do. And I was just like, how is this? This isn't real. Right. <laughs> like what? Yeah. But listen, she, she went in on my life, Loki. She was like, you know, she was like, um, and take this very lightly, but you need to, she's like, if you're a creative, you definitely need to tap into that. Like you have to do something creative on a regular basis. You need to feed that creative. I was just sitting there looking at her. Like, I don't got the time to be told about this type of shit. Girl, like, I really, like, I really don't like lady. I know. Okay. I just know. <laughs> the Please. fuck. Who, t- who sent you? Like, go away. Mm-hmm. And then she was also saying that, like, I need to basically, I need to exercise. <laughs> Oh fudge! Oh <laughs> shit! No, bro, this bitch was. I was like, nah, you fake dog. Fuck you. <laughs> she was like, you know, don't set a goal to it. Don't like, you know, if you need to just go for like a morning walk around your neighborhood, or I don't know if you have a gym membership, but you know, yes, just man. go to the gym or like go for a walk or do some yeah, kind of exercise, walk, yoga. Uh, she was like, just I... be in movement. Listen, just be in movement and don't. She was like, she emphasized though, not setting a goal or putting a goal, That's like pinning a goal to it. Yeah, because that, that is what it is. That's yeah. Why yeah. Always ruins it for me. Yeah. That's Always why ruins it for me. I don't feel like And when I just go and don't think about it, just go straight yes. and don't think about where I'm trying to go, I get further. Oh, I yep. hate that shit, man. Yep. You, 
I would like to be structured and put it in place. Discipline. Then you try to I need discipline. Then you get thrown off. Then you're like, if it, I don't want to do it no more. Exactly. I need discipline. That's my problem. But no, don't we? Yes, I say this to myself every day. Don't worry. Yeah. Every day. And I I'm was like, just I, like, but I'm gonna take my time because we have to give ourselves grace. Okay. Exactly. And, I'm and also, I feel like a lot of things are just been like lately have been like just screaming at me, and I'm mm -hmm. just like. Can I get some earplugs? Like, oh. I had a dream, like, this morning. Mm -mm. I ain't gonna say, because, you know, my dreams. I don't know y'all like that. <laughs> um, it was great. I saw someone that, a family member that passed that I loved. And mm -hmm. um, she had asked me a question, like, years ago. Like, 10, 15 years ago. Mm -hmm. And in the dream or whatever, she was saying it to me like it was live. Like, it was happening now. Mm -hmm. And it was just like. So what you going to do kind of thing? Oh, like, this is what I said. Now what? And I was just like, oh, my gosh. But I have to I get it and I know it and I feel it. I just have to figure mm -hmm. out how the hell. It's funny you say that because a Where, post just, just before <laughs> dog, just before I got on the show, like I'm on Instagram scrolling and this post comes up and it says it is time to embrace the light you had to repress in order to feel safe the oh, light you thought God. didn't have its place in the world the light even people who loved you most didn't know how to nurture and appreciate mm -hmm. you are the alchemist you've been waiting for mm -hmm. bitch I was like mm -hmm. okay yeah yeah okay mm -hmm. okay fine yeah. sure whatever yeah. <laughs> and yep. then like my pattern reminder has been like kicking me in pattern, the ass on girl, top of that play with pattern or marker pattern Listen, too much for me sometime I pattern said you're independent and follow your own instincts it's important you take action to achieve your career goals and not sit back and wait for permission good lord like please relax <laughs> fuck i don't even know i have pattern still i don't even think i mess with that no more like that mm -hmm. i have co-star but not pattern pattern be just i feel like pattern just give me the same shit sometimes over and over and over again yeah a lot of it is reminders but sometimes it like comes at like the right time but it just be like Arr! but mm -hmm. yeah oh and me being me i was like let me look more into this aura shit right child there's an app <laughs> Mm. This is what my image looked like from the app. Jeez. Right? Like it, it looks, looks so cool worse. though. But yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. And same thing. I'm getting the same color stones, basically. Amethyst, garnet, carnelian, mm -hmm. like those. And I was just like. Oh, and it gives you your stones based off that too? Mm-hmm. And it says your atmosphere is lighting a fire around you. This is a time for action. So harness the spark and bridge the gap by taking initiative. You may even surprise yourself. Mm. so that's where oh, i'm at in life right now <laughs> your attentive logic won't fail you okay. <laughs> what <laughs> please girl it's okay to be irritated when you're mentally scattered just try not to overcomplicate simplicity listen that's my life this is not a simple world that we're living in here like For i don't it's not so cut and dry yeah i just want them to really think about this <laughs> <laughs> Sheesh. Mm -hmm. I want to do one. Would I do one? Wait, is it good? It's okay. Let me, I don't know. Let me, I, I I mean, I don't feel too bad. You know, I just get real touchy about these things. I know you won. I know you won. You know, I'm not into certain, um, yeah. Boom, you know, we love Harry Potter and all that, but I'm not into certain yeah. foolishness. I like the imagination of him. I know I really do. This the reality saying, sometimes. So. Or thing sounds cool. I'm going to send like, you the link a, to the app. But what's the app going to do? I can do it through the app? Yeah, that's the one that I sent you. The, the picture I just showed you, that was through the app. Oh, I thought yeah. oh I thought because you did it there they sent you like a No, no, no. I was fasting and looking at stones. Oh my, how much is this? How much is this? The app is free. Yeah. Oh, the app There's is free? There's a free trial. Um I don't know what it give you a lot of information what kind with of free the free trial? trial. Like a real free trial or free like trial. A like no, 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 no. You like know, your credit card. No, no, I mean, no, your no, card no, 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 no. You know me. I'm cheap. Hell oh, no. Okay. I thought it was Child. one of them free trials. No, 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 <laughs> baby. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Don't, seem free. <laughs> don't seem free to me. Nah, I don't. You have to take the picture and uh, whatever. And... Yeah, and it has you like put your thumbs on the screen so it like picks up on your aura. Like it kind of emulates the thing that I did in person. <laughs> so. You know you're going to yeah. do this, right? You gonna do it right now? I mean, no, but right, no. I think about it. I think about doing it right now. I might. I might. Oh my gosh! But I'm yeah, gonna... what else going on? First of all, a lot is going on. I'm just too tired, much. Though. I think that's what it is. I am tired of it. I'm tired of 
I don't know. Being black is exhausting right now. Before we get to that, before <laughs> we get to that, can we talk about Jamaica and these strikes last week? Um, yeah, I didn't pay too much attention. I saw some of the things like when Sparks put it up and whatnot. Listen. And that's what put them outside. But what was really keeping? So NWC, the National Water mm-hmm. Committee, whatever the hell the C stand for. The people that who in charge of the water in Jamaica <laughs> went on strike for like two days. The mm-hmm. whole island. If you didn't catch water or live by a stream or a river, you were waterless well, i love some country people have their tank listen listen i don't have no tank <laughs> and <laughs> freaking shout out to julie mango and how fast she dropped that video though <laughs> girl all who don't have no damn tank and yet i don't even have drama catch water when it's mm-hmm. a rain so maybe me go check it on my people i asked my father if he have water, this man will come send me a paragraph about how he 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 drinks directly from the stream and he harvests water. Okay, period. <laughs> Sir, <laughs> just say period. yes and done. Oh, shit. I was like, see, that's why I came out like this because of people like you. So they didn't have water. Then as soon as the water come back, no. National air traffic people went on strike. So... <laughs> the whole island shut down. No in or out by plane because... In right. our air traffic control. And of course, you know, people them did upset. Of course. Somebody said they knew somebody who was on a flight from North Carolina with Flag of Jamaica and they couldn't land. They swung that plane right back around and went back to North Carolina. I was like, what? what? When I said I would be pissed, you on a flight for like six hours and ain't go nowhere, if not more. But I, I, listen, I understand why the people them do it though, because everybody know how most jobs are. Whether it's a, at a government level or entry level or whatever the hell it is, they're going to try to get as much out of you for as little as possible. Facts. And on top of that, these people don't have the tools to do the work that they're being requested to do. So it's kind of anyway. like, you're not paying me. You're mm-hmm. not giving me the shit I need to get the job done. So what, what you more want? you want by me? Like, so yeah, they supposedly got the help they needed and whatever. So the people that have gone back to work, there's somebody else did it too. I can't remember who came after that, but mm-hmm. I heard somebody else came and strike after that. But those two were the ones I was just like, Arr! I was like, Jesus, Listen, no water, no flights. Like F everything right now. Mm-hmm. Let's just wild out right now. Cause yeah. why not? I don't blame them at all. But I'm tired. <sighs> um, let me talk about your home girl. Um, Who which home girl let? No, 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 <laughs> no. When you say that, I just feel like you're about to talk about this tough gal. And I <laughs> don't want go ahead, because it cause it needs to be said. Because clearly. Okay. We've spoken about this young lady before. Actually, mm-hmm. I think we talked about her last week. We laugh about her all the time. We huh? talk I said talked about, not laughed about, but okay. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Um, I think we talked about her last week how she decided she wasn't going to run pull mm-hmm. out last minute about Ray Tete and of course she show up on um, which one of them platform talking about how she was in a relationship with somebody who didn't love her wait a sec let me read the message y'all she was she was in her feelings and I'm not discrediting her feelings go you sis whatever but right. the post said I don't understand how someone can just walk out of your life and not care about you anymore and she decides uh, to attack on pun it and said I was in a relationship with a Jamaican athlete that never cared about me from jump I was abused and stole from stolen from okay stole from look who yet you're projected about. projected her protected her from the judgment of her country and family while they dragged me I had to deal with homophobic and so much more that I'm still healing from. Okay, right? So, first of all, I thought she had a girlfriend when we first heard about her. I guess she had a girl mashup and she go find next Oman. Okay, cool, bet. Then she put her next post. Yeah. Oh, shit. Then she do her next post. Read what it says. Okay. That said, protect yourself because I was in love with a whole act and posted the girl's picture. Mm, right. Okay, so because y'all broke up, you're not protecting her no more? Um, you have you been in the world today? Like these days? Nah. But the thing about it is, I think she didn't she obviously wasn't thinking because she went and deleted the picture later. But me get a screenshot before she deleted the picture. A lot of people got the screenshot. Exactly, because a lot of people posted it afterwards. And I'm just like, this isn't even a picture that's hiding a person's face enough for us to be like, oh, we don't know who that. Because you have like 
wow, you crossed out the name brand that was on the people them shirt. But majority of the person's face is showing. Exactly. If this is somebody who's a Jamaican athlete, somebody is gonna know who they are. Be not know I'm gonna keep up with sports too much, but like seriously? Yeah. <laughs> like, as a member of the community, I don't know what the fuck she identifies as. Why are you out in people? Because that's what people do. She kind of you could you could tell it's kind of like listen you did this to me so I'm gonna put you out there and you notice ain't nobody bring up the girl name I love that so it was real real I like, love crush, that crush. everybody like a who that the who that the who that I love that who is that and I'm looking at her, my thing is the fact that she went back and deleted before. it though I was like you know you fucked up post and delete because it was up there long enough because I went and got my little screenshot just like it was two everybody. hours just ago like when she people, posted it people in relationships same thing post and delete. <sighs> I don't know. Like that shit. When I saw, I was like, "Why would you? Why would you do that?" Like, girl, okay, you got hurt. Who told you to deal with a Jamaican? No offense, but like, <laughs> but it's and the also in the comments from me talking about, "Oh, you ain't know. You can tell. Look at her. Da da da." Just by looking at her X Y Z, I was like, "Look, find some old criminal, to know." Wait, you know, looking no- at. Looking at the girl? Yes, or... people in the comments were saying, oh, she looked like she's a crumb. She looked like she's stale. She looked like she this, and she looked like she that. I'm like, how you see that? How is that possible? That's what you see? Because it's tough gal who not run from mine in? Hmm. Because she said something? That's the problem. You mix up in a drama too much. I'm not running off. Hate to exactly. See. Literally. Hate to see. Please. Like, always mix up in our dramas. Always something extra going on. Where's the running? That's what we know you for. Where's the running? Hold on, friend. Me don't want to cut you, but me do the little something. The little Mm -hmm. something. And a beer blue one sitting around me. What you call them? Say, oh, wait, I have a sheet, a cheat sheet. Let me see if I can go find it. a cheat sheet, yeah. But what can I Yeah, they gave me a little package with my picture and stuff. Listen, I'm not telling them what you can find. Blue, blue one, purple sitting. Mm -mm. Hmm, let me send this come, girl. So oh, you can shit. read it and feel like All a right. teacher. So hold yeah. on, hold on. All right, Miss Senegal Gear still. Y'all, she made me do this thing. <laughs> yeah, she made me do this thing, you guys, and a beer blue and purple something there on my head. So what that mean now? You see, when you listen to your friends, they end up doing all type of fuckery. Um, all right. All type of analysis. I will keep you for. Yeah, you see when they follow your friend, they're gonna do stuff. <laughs> this is what my body used to tell me though. Don't follow <laughs> my, I was just talking about how my mom used to tell us, "Don't follow nobody, go do nothing." I oh, yours there. is pretty, bad, pretty bad. Wow, you don't know what pretty mean. Turquoise. Oh, I have quartz too on mine. Mm-hmm. This it, thing was pretty on the backside. Let me see if quartz was a descendant. I'm like, that is. Ooh, I'm scared. <laughs> Oh no, my quartz was etheria. I didn't even look to look into that one. But... Turquoise. <gasps> or okay. Ten. Y'all, it's blue and it's some purple. I ain't got no red oh. though. Oh. That mother effer was red. Yours was red. I ain't got no red. Isn't that funny? <laughs> Twins. That's but so funny. But here we are. <laughs> <laughs> here we are. Okay, so blue. Keywords, spiritual, highly intuitive, nurturing, compassionate, sensitive, forgiving, loyal, spiritual, deep, nurturing, devoted, trustworthy, dutiful, peaceful, faithful, altruistic, idealistic, visionary, seeking, receptive, highlights, healing, aspiring, serene, gifted, Hmm. low lights, sloppy, complacent, distrusting, lethargic, dull, melancholy, Bless God, all of them straight across the board. (laughs) All of them shits. Okay, and then you have like a little violet over there on the side. Well, violet, you know. Unconventional, artistic, visionary, risk-taking, charismatic, humanitarian, inspiring, dignified, noble, self-respecting, royal, tolerant, considerate, (laughs) soothing, calming, humble, ethical, peacemaking, highly regarded, free-thinking, visionary, magnetic. Your highlight... (laughs) <laughs> not one lie was told <laughs> light up please <laughs> your yeah. highlights sublime mystical connected with ancestors angels yeah. spirit guides highly spiritual highest aura level 
Um, the low lights, <laughs> demanding, inconsiderate, prideful, arrogant, perfectionist, impractical. <laughs> That all just screams Leo. <laughs> this is all I'm saying, right? <laughs> but, um, you know, and there's a little bit of green in there. Mm. Um, the keywords healing, teaching, organized, entrepreneurial, highly intelligent, driven, successful, perfectionistic, empowering, capable, adaptable, generous, cooperative, soothing, conscientious, understanding, secure, protective, harmonious, free, lucky. Highlights, evolved, loving, trustworthy, loyal. Lowlights, miserly? <laughs> okay. Insecure, envious, selfish, suspicious, brooding. Mm. Jesus. <laughs> Talk about it, though. What Listen, on my rough colors? days, don't ramp in them. <laughs> Listen, send me all that. All that good stuff, send me all that. I'm going to need you to go ahead and do that. Thanks, love. Yeah. Thank you. I'm going to take a picture and send it to you. <laughs> So what that, you say? That's that's good. Like what's what they what they talking about? I mean, about? it's you. Shit, it is right. <laughs> like it's not, that sound like a peaceful, smart restaurant, right? Yeah, basically, literally. <laughs> what they say about my ancestors? Successful. I'm connected with them. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, we knew that, but yeah, okay. Very much so because you already know. Lock <laughs> in with them. Yeah. Okay, I like it. That's a lot of yeah. blue. Shit. Yeah. You got my favorite color and I got yours? Yes. <laughs> Hilarious. Because I'm there like, I think mine's going to be blue. She's like, yeah, I'm like is mine going to be red? Not her red in sight. <laughs> Bitch, you thought. Yeah. Y'all should go ahead and do that. It's cute. The, um, on the aura colors for the ones that I received, let me just read the keywords that they had on there. Mm -hmm. It was, um, it was like a lot of red and orange in mine. Mm -hmm. So for the red, strong, passionate, hardworking, grounded, literal, raw, courageous, gritty, sexual, honest, sensual, yep. confident, mm -hmm. motivated, stimulated, willful, primal, initiating, persistent, driven, powerful, physical, intense. Mm -hmm. Highlights, friendly and forgiving. Low lights, crude, <laughs> cruel, resentful, angry, brutal, ruthless. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna say that's wrong. Um, don't piss me off. That's all. It's pretty, uh, simple. pretty orange, standard. Orange keywords are creative, outgoing, assertive, enthusiastic, vivacious, impulsive, healthy, vivacious. creative, joyful, buoyant, spontaneous, positive, communicative, enterprising, adventurous, resourceful, strategic. Highlights, mm -hmm. outgoing, overcoming, blissful. Lowlights, overbearing, overwhelming, flamboyant, joyless, melancholy. <laughs> Damn. Okay, shout out to the melancholy gang. <laughs> because real. just sometimes, bitch, you need Listen, to be a little melancholy. Yes. Just a little bit. Just Shit, a little bit. It's balanced. Nigga, we can't be mm -hmm. all that and don't have no down days. Yeah. There's no way you can expect all that up without a little bit of down. You exactly. Crazy? And yeah, then people get pissed there was, though when they hear all this good shit and then uh, they hear some bad shit. They be like, "What? What you mean? Not me?" Because so it's can't four be true. little negatives, and we got all please. this positive. I am Calm both down. day and a night. And then for the magenta, we have nonconformist, creative, intelligent, free spirited, eccentric, original, center of attention, strong willed, unique, innovative, dedicated. Reverent, grateful, mature, compassionate, gentle, warm, nurturing, original. And then the highlights, unconditionally loving, evolved, mm -hmm. dedicated, mature. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. The low lights, arrogant, dominating, insecure, lacking self-love. The fuck? Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. Right, that last one, I... Mm. 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 Come mm. love me. Sometimes mm -hmm. we like bad treatment, so we can't say that, maybe a little well, bit. I think, I think that's what it is. <laughs> I think that's what it is, the bad I'm working treatment. on it. <laughs> Because we'll be like, my love, look at bad treatment. And you look at it like <laughs> on a real level. If you like bad treatment, do you really yeah. like yourself? Yeah. Mm. Yeah, but okay, still bad treatment. Just a little bit. <laughs> just, you know, just a little taste, just a little pinch. Yeah, just keep a it bit. spicy. Just a little pinch. <laughs> yeah, but um oh, that's that. that friend. Y'all should do that. Look yeah. into that. What was the app name? Orla, A U R L A. Uh, this is not a promotional no, anything. They ain't, ain't paying nobody. But it's yeah, they're not paying don't nobody. So if y'all want to do it, I don't know if they have it on Android, but it's on um iPhones. iPhone. So yeah, um, if y'all want to pay and get um the full extensive reading, which I personally don't believe that's I should a, do, that's too much. 
because mm-hmm. I can literally Google all the information they gave us because they gave us a lot of information on the free thing because we could <laughs> we can definitely discuss this one after because mm-hmm. whatever but ma'am turn it to the side look a bit girl it's like Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. We definitely would do that after because yellow and I all look like a damn sunflower. <laughs> yes. For real. Don't Funny as hell. Don't do Hold on there. Child. You know what? No, we want it. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Share. <laughs> you got to share it with you or you can see it from her. You can send it to me. Send it to me. Um, what you okay so for those who ain't been peeping what's going on so i had my lady say hello lady hi okay so i had her go ahead and um do it too and her oh my gosh this is so true though oh fuck oh, <laughs> i'm talking about hurts. like really? <laughs> my head hurts okay and hers is like we all yellow. different colors bouncing oh around this gosh. bitch dish. ain't it pretty though that's a yellow yes. bag yes Hey, you wow. like sunflower? No, okay, I call you my little sunflower for a reason. You exactly. see? Wow, we this is gay. okay. Um, um, anyways, you so, a punk? <laughs> citrine and garnet are her stones. Which, oh my gosh, yes. Um, yellow keywords for yellow: energetic, optimistic, childlike, fun-loving, happy, free-spirited, radiant, cheerful, bright, open-minded, hopeful, glowing, wise, knowledgeable, generous. Mm-hmm. Highlights, discerning, discriminating, inspiring, sunny. <laughs> sunny, that's funny. Right. Um, low lights, deceptive, controlling, malicious, <laughs> manipulating, pessimistic. Whoa. My throat. <laughs> Where is my water? Help. Are we on the air? Hello. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, are we on it? Tap, tap. Are we on the air? Anyways, um, right? um, we got some green in there. Oh, this is cute. I'm going to be like the lady. The green is on the outside. I think you might need to tap into that a little bit more and bring it closer. But anyways, <laughs> my spit party people have something. <laughs> um, green keywords, healing, teaching, organized, entrepreneurial, highly intelligent, driven, successful, perfectionistic, empowering, capable, adaptable, generous, cooperative, soothing, conscientious, understanding, secure, protective, harmonious, free, lucky. And then highlights, evolved, loving, trustworthy, loyal. Lowlights, miserly, insecure, envious, selfish, suspicious, brooding. Um, You had green in yours too, so that was like, that sounds familiar. But yeah, hers is like more vibrant yeah, well, towards up well. around the edges. See you? <laughs> and then red, which is some of the ones that I had. Um, strong, passionate, hardworking, grounded, literal, raw, courageous, gritty, sexual, honest, sensual, confident, motivated. Because (laughs) I'm still reading the horse. Sorry. (laughs) Motivated, stimulated, willful, primal, initiating, persistent, driven, powerful, physical, intense. Highlights: friendly and forgiving. Low lights: crude, cruel, resentful, angry, brutal, and ruthless. So primal and um, sexual, sexual and, and sensual, yes. Oh, but y'all both got that, right? Yes. It's just like, I just yes. have to be walking around with whores all the time, <laughs> and I don't understand. Like, good behaving person like me. Birds of a feather, what I'm saying? No, no, girl. No, girl. Are you a mm-hmm. noir? <laughs> Shit. So that's cute. All right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. However, though, whatever. This was cute, and it was nice and touching. But let's mm-hmm. get into the facts. <clears throat> mm-hmm. You ready to talk about this? Yeah. Okay. Caution, warning, trigger warning, etc. Because you know Brace we can yourselves. be a little, we can be a little rough with things. But I kind of just say what the hell is on my mind up front, and I don't kind of, I'm not editing it. No. Um, I hope everyone has heard. Well, I I hope. Well, you need to be aware. I hope everyone has heard about this shooting. Mm-hmm. <sighs> uh, That's something you outside. Twitched it. What can I say? Yes, like, yes. Like that. Who did you watch that? You know, you know, I didn't. Yeah, you don't because you're like her. But I am the watcher and I got to see all things. I don't care. A part of me wants to see it. But another part of me is just like, I'm. You know what I'll say? (laughs) Is the video still up? I don't know if it's still up, but I know 
I had it in a place, and if you would like to see yeah. that, I can send it to oh, you. Oh, hold if on. It's still For those present. who don't know, Twitch is a streaming platform. Um, it's designated, uh, well, originally created for gamers, so you can watch gamers play live um, mm -hmm. when they play singularly or with another person on the computer or whatever. Mm -hmm. Since covid it has evolved into just More an overall just streaming now. everything now. yeah overall streaming platforms I actually have a podcast of uh, an account for the podcast, podcast. i've never used okay. it for it um but you know so you can watch live as we record they have asmr on like there that anymore in life that should have been <laughs> when i was in my room on the stage. yes what like, boom boom Listen, like I'd have, I'd have me a little check you'd have been rich Listen. and then also um if you what else do they have? they have a bunch of DJs were living on um st um streaming on Twitch back it's, during yeah. the pandemic too. Yeah, so facts, it's facts. just an overall streaming platform. You can watch people live as they do what they do. And that's what he chose to do. Addy and Eccentrics them was on at one time, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, Addy was big doing up, it, I think, Addy, every Thursday. Eccentrics, of course. Yeah. But um he twitched the whole thing. And it like, let the whole thing play. No, no, there was no. What I like, saw, I saw like a minute and change of it, and that was from him driving in the car, getting there, shooting the people outside, getting inside, shooting the people inside. That and all happened within a minute. Well, yeah, Listen, it's an automatic and he, rifle. And he, we got to the part with him reloading, and trigger warning again. There was a lady on the ground, and he, she had already been shot previously, and he could see that she still wasn't dead, and he just pat pat. That's all in the video, like clapped her out like it was you know for me it doesn't bother me like that because i want to i need to see what the hell going on i don't mm -hmm. like word of mouth because people tell things way differently than what they yeah. are i like to see it rough as fuck i'm it makes me sick because other than just being black people it was all these like grown older, older women people. yes and me like me and my criminal you know minds. what i'm saying so it kind of made me feel a way like mm -hmm. and there and um I saw something on Twitter today. I don't know if you saw it and it had all the people. Yeah, I have the thread. list here. Yeah. In the thread of all the people, um, what they did for the community, what oh. their ages were, how many kids, who whatever is left. Oh, my gosh. Yo. So in total, there were 10 people left dead mm -hmm. and uh, what was it? Three injured. Mm -hmm. that went to the hospital i don't know what the status is on the people that were injured but first of all i saw a picture of the gun oh the n-word on on the on the not tip. just that all the names that he had written on the gun also were like previously like other radical mass shooters who did like racial mm -hmm. crimes so i'm just like and y'all trying to figure out what what was the root of this? I don't understand this country, period. And yeah, My I understand is, it. No, I it, understand it. I know, but in, in the United <laughs> States of cat, let me tell you how this will go. In the United States of sugar, you understand? Listen, you do something like this, it's pretty clear to see, hello, on Twitch in real life that you did this. There is no pleading what there is, is no nothing there's no need to he have any kind of not guilty we're not gonna waste money shit. we're not gonna waste time like your ass is underneath the jail and they're gonna try and say it was a mental disorder or some shit i know they are bro and right. they're talking about some oh he was he was um stressed it was brought on due to like covid stress yeah, or that. whatever the fuck I thought that his family was saying that i was and that tells you COVID. enough that tells we you all depressed during covid i didn't that go around tells shooting white you people that tells you what kind of family he comes from and that's all you need to know about it if your parents or if anybody is defending this you know the kind of people they are yeah nobody can defend this the shit. fact that he went 200 and something miles away from his home to find a black neighborhood to do this in that you couldn't just go to any grocery store and go shoot them up no you had to go no. 200 and something miles away to go do this what's crazy is how when he was walking around there and he ran up on the white dude. Oh yeah, he said I'm sorry. Had the nerve to say sorry. Mm -hmm. Like you, yeah, you you for real, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think okay. DC Young Fly posted the video and Instagram removed the video from his page, so he oh, had posted. Still, it's again. back up there still. It's oh, all okay. over now. It's back up. It's like one person saw it, caught it, and now you know when it spread like wildfire, they can't mm -hmm. do nothing with it. It's yo, I don't know. Um, like that part alone should be enough for you to know that he was targeting black people specifically and it wasn't just oh it's a coincidence it has me away because 
I have sisters, aunts, my mother, people. They go to the supermarket all the time. Mm-hmm. My my friends, mom, anybody, moms. They go to the store all the time. They Just a random shit. thing to go get their damn stuff for their house to the supermarket. And you trying to tell me you can't be black in America at the end of you, the day? Well, you never could. Exactly. You never really could. That's what we I said. I understand. I understand. <laughs> literally. That's what I said. I understand what it is. You, I, I'm not even going to sit here and be like, I don't understand. I understand at the end of the day. And, um, oh, shit. I need to look it up so I, can, I don't say it I don't even know what it is. When I say I don't understand, it's more like I just. People sick, man. I just. I think I, I don't, yeah, maybe I don't understand the level of hatred, right? Mm-hmm, that part. Because I can't see myself hating someone, mm-hmm. a group of people, for what reason exactly? Like, I, I the stupidity, Skin color. like, dark, dark body. Like, and this nigga had a whole manifesto. Like, <laughs> yeah, I heard about that. And what he had can? the 14, the number 14 written on his gun. Um, apparently that is, wow. No, I'm not clicking that. Um, that's the video? apparently, no, no, no. It was some other shit. Cause I'm on the, what is this? Oh, this is fighting hate for good. Okay. That's, that's a good website I'm on. Okay. okay. But it's called, um, 14 words. Mm-hmm. And it's a reference to the most popular white supremacist slogan in the world, which mm-hmm. says we must secure the existence of our people and a future for white children. Yep. How about I feel the same way? <laughs> the slogan no, was coined by, was it? David Lane, a member of the white supremacist terrorist group known as The Order. And like, not a Phoenix, huh? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Another Harry Potter joke for y'all. Anyway, <clears throat> lighten up. Um, yeah, you know, so that number was written on his gun. And... It's like real simple. Like if you don't like people, stay away from them. You don't like them, don't talk to them. You don't like them, don't fuck with them. But because I know black people, people, they're not finna go out of their way to go talk to no white folks. This is what I'm saying. We listen. You be like, we don't like you. We don't listen. It bad uh, by the skin on the blow of teeth. Bad. Listen, it's by the skin <laughs> of your teeth. Okay, by the skin of your teeth. Because the thing about the time, it, I, we don't want to talk to them either. But we also not running up and and doing that. If we start doing that, then we really going to have an issue around this place. Hmm. And watch how crazy it get. He ain't never going to make it out the supermarket. My thing is, right, I feel like black people, like we are, no matter what people say about us as a whole, whether we're Caribbean, whether we're from Africa directly, whether we're in America, whatever, wherever you are from that the diaspora, whatever, as black people as a whole, I don't feel like, I don't know what it is about us. We're just not evil like that. Nope. Like we just like how many serial killers are black? How many of the mass shootings have been black people? Like <sighs> Listen, people think when I be calling them animals like I'm joking. I am not mm. joking. They're a legit animals. And like I said already today on Instagram, don't be offended and be in my thing. Oh, you sound da 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 da. I don't want to hear none of that. If it does not apply, let it let fly. it fly. Okay, I don't care. Like if it, it literally, if it doesn't fucking apply to you, leave it the fuck alone. Because I'm sure somebody you know, if you are white, that's what I'm saying. Feels this way, thinks this way, or d- isn't isn't phased by it. Exactly. And if you white and, and I fuck with you, and you know I fuck with you, then it's just that. Exactly. Indifference does not solve the problem. So Thanks. that's actually a part of the problem that you contributes to like the problem. Self in thing, like, oh, you was talking. Why don't you shut the hell up? There was. Is it you? Is it you? Because hit dogs. And also, bruh, I hate when white people are like, oh, I don't see color. Don't play with me. I hate. I hate that shit all the time. <laughs> Bruh. Are you colorblind? Or... And even if you are colorblind, as someone who has studied photography, um, mm. there are gradients and you will be able to tell the difference if somebody is black or white. Right, right. So, exactly. That's what I thought. Suck my okay. dick. <laughs> well, that's gotta be unreal. Ooh. Just, oh, that's... Mm. That's gotta be kind of cool though, ain't it? Like, <laughs> seeing everything. I feel yeah, like they just... Black and white, but the, the, the contrast between black mm-hmm. and white, legit has to be the coolest part yeah i'm such like 
an image weirdo with that mm-hmm. because like I can also differentiate between other shades when mm-hmm. you're looking at like black and white pictures I can tell mm-hmm. if something is like more red or blue mm-hmm. or something like that but mm-hmm. we ain't talking about actual color we're talking about skin color and y'all are stupid I don't see color we're all no you need to see color to understand the those, those are the, those are the sister. all lives matter people no you need to be able to see this color to understand what the fuck is going on you can't just not see the color I'm not trying to hear that we don't have the same experiences yeah, that like yeah. you can't go to the fucking grocery store, dog. Yeah, you can't go to school. You can't go to the grocery store. Listen, you, you can't, can't go, go to the mall. You can't go to the grocery store. Listen, them groceries going to be delivered till forever. Rarely. <laughs> they already were, but they they ain't gonna stop. Sorry, to that tell shit you. Loki touched me in a way because I'm like, dog, I be going out of my way to go to the black ass Caribbean ass grocery store. But once again, I had a thought. Right. Mm -hmm. Because these little shootings always feel very hmm, to me. Very Mm -hmm. like, oh, hey, look, another one popped up Mm -hmm. again. Let's see. I feel like they said within the last 40 hours, they've been 10, like 10. Yes, I saw that as well. (sighs) My thing is it's it's, these shootings are kind of funny to me. All the ones that have happened, schools and Mm -hmm. people at the festivals in these churches and stuff. You know, I all think it's all one big swirl Mm -hmm. of people doing all the same shit because it's always the same gun same this same that Mm -hmm. right what do you think do you think it's a setup do you think it was real do you think it was what you think it's staged not staged but this shit just keeps happening and it's always the same and you're gonna hear about this about homeboy and then you're not gonna hear shit about him ever again oh yeah have you heard shit about the rest of these people that shot up absolutely not like where they at this is what I'm saying. They make an trying- example out of one every so often to make to keep us quiet, to calm us down, to make us feel like, oh, they're doing something. And, you know, they're they're not mm-hmm. allowing it to happen. But at the end of the day, it's kind of like. Y'all are trying to wipe niggas out like y'all are legit trying to wipe niggas out. And when yeah. I say niggas, I'm not speaking specifically black people, but I mean, we have been targeted on a <laughs> forever yeah. on a yeah. scale. So it's kind of like it's, it's kind of hard to just be like mm, meh. like you're mm-hmm. you're being willfully blind if that's what the take is that you're taking because right. it's like between police shootings between this fuckery right here and any other thing that has been a target to black people to like it's just what other country does this Especially at this scale, like between gun control, I'm not going to be here and sit here and be like, oh, you need to da da da. But I don't know if you heard it, but like apparently last year or some shit, he was, um, he made threats about shooting up the graduation or something, his high school graduation or some shit. If that's what happened, why was he able to get a gun? Granted, I know 18 years old, you can go get your automatic rifle, you can't get a handgun, blah, blah, which is fucking wild to me. Exactly. Like, why was this not flagged so that you know? Hey, warning! This nigga might want to go do some wild shit with a gun. There are all these, all of these people that did this shit should have been flagged. They've all done something previous. In the past, thing. it's not a first yes, time that thing. Looks crazy. It's that's why I'm saying it's a joke at this point. It's all yeah. a joke. It's a joke. Like yeah. I don't know what we. And you know what's through. funny? Like, are we gonna? We're about to get start marching again. Like, what's going on? We are about to start crumping Man, it for like police you're up again. That shit. I'm gonna go get my gun. I keep saying it. Yeah, I'm about to go like, get niggas my want shit. to stay dangerous in the supermarket. You trying to get and you I have my concealed do. weapons <laughs> license. I'm gonna bring that shit everywhere. Like, where we going? Of course, I'm not places scared. where we can't. But I'm it's it's just it. nah. I'm trying <sighs> to go get my Doritos. I gotta worry. I know. Like, I keep the what? thing on me to go get some damn ice cream. You like, I just want some ice cream. I'm menstruating right now. Like, I just want nah, some brownies bro. and some ice cream. Listen. And I got to worry about bleeding through an open wound. Okay, <laughs> like, no, we both, we both going to be bloody, bitch. Let me tell you that right now. <laughs> <laughs> tell you that right now. No funny shit, my nigga. Like, <laughs> I hate that so much. Hey, the other day I dead messaged my father and I was like, can you finish Not building you this house? Messaged him. Hold Sorry. on. Whoa. I- <laughs> Whoa. Okay. And I was like, um, can you finish building this house so I can move home? Oh, girl. Mm. This man texted me back and said, come so I can put your name on the thing. And I was like, don't, don't you just love me? the luxury? I said, I said, I said, this is 
is me. I said, Daddy, don't play with me. He said, you see Listen. me laughing? He said, you know, I'm going in the little box soon. I can't take it with me. I was like, Oh, what I the- hate that shit. Shut <sighs> up. Shut up. Don't start that, man. I said, like, why must you be like this? Like, damn. I was I like, this is me. I'm going to be down there Um, come August for a birthday thing. Yeah. He said, he said, the birthday can't change. <laughs> He coming? Because I asked if... I, I, listen, it's coffee season. That's what he told me. It's coffee season. Listen, man. Come talk about come some... Come thing, man. Talk <laughs> about thing the birthday can't change. I said, Daddy, I'm coming regardless. If, mm-hmm. if I can't see you in the way that I want to see you, I'm going to see you. Mm-hmm. But, you know, whatever. I, was, I can come again. It's not the one trip I'm taking for the year unless something right. happens, knock on wood. So, but, you know... Mm-hmm. But I was like, listen, he. I want to see him and your dad interact so bad. Yeah, <laughs> like I want to know how that would work. I always want to see. I want to see everybody interact with my father because <sighs> I feel like my just, mother and your father would be like best friends. Oh, I think they would be. They perfect. would love each other. I Honestly, feel like they would <laughs> until they start until they catch up in an argument. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 But that's mm-hmm. not in anybody, honestly. But. And yes, my mother. So the F- the, yeah, you'd be good for like five minutes, and then mm-hmm. oops. Uh, yeah. I feel like as long as they find something they can laugh about, they're going to be yeah. okay. Oh, yeah. And they will find something to laugh yeah. about. But I think, like, party setting, to what them? Hot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What? When music uh, drop? That's what, what I'm saying. When foot them right? start drop? Say, exactly. Oh. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> the two of them start skank. Oh, my God. I haven't but. spoken to my mom since this whole thing happened. Oh really? I'm a, I'm a link her. I mean, it's just I text mine. I haven't really talked to her about it. Cause... I hate to be weird about shit. I hate when shit happens and it's like, okay, let me go I'm run check- and go check yes, on you. Yes, I hate, I that. hate that. I had just spoke to them though, not to say mm-hmm. like I just spoke to my family recently, like mm-hmm. a few days ago. But I didn't want to be like, hey, mommy, huh? You yeah, know, you right. Good, you good? You, yeah, because you right. it's too close for comfort. Like, it's a bit much, and I don't want her get her all riled up and sensitive about it. Get her all riled up, like yeah, and they'll be like, what happened? You saw what happened on the news, so you checking for me? My parents is rank, okay? Ex- that I, too. And also, like, oh, look the my fact that I know y'all call me. We're out here alone quote-unquote also yeah. i don't want that worry thing to kick that's in what too. i'm saying too because i know once i hit her up i'm gonna hear that mm-hmm. i know make it. sure say so yeah take care of yourself and all yeah, yeah. daddy be like mm, no more rule than all like, <laughs> sir do you know my life i don't go anywhere <laughs> unless i go somewhere you understand what i'm saying <laughs> those who get it get speaking, it speaking of speaking of um, what is it yeah, yeah, come true for uh, my carnival my carnival my carnival's talking about me boy atlanta carnival wait which one ain't there like 10 there's two okay <laughs> Annie Love did a special last week um while she out Wednesday on is bad or going to anything where she's Annie going? going to stuff I need to find out what that's she what I'm is saying. doing find out what Annie going and then I don't know but I mean we yeah. didn't really say I mean we were uh, why look at you you look at your face your face look like mischief <laughs> I just want to go to my usual things. I want to see what their juve is like. So I know you want to. So I know that means Monday you're gone. Okay, yes. everybody off too. Okay. Yes. Okay, everybody. Yes. Um, you're going to SSS. You know it. Let me see. Tickets high though. I, I didn't probably, know they dropped tickets yes, from fucking. I probably will not last be year. I will not be attending that one, but I will probably be attending the one October. Okay. Yeah, you're not so, touch SSS, no? No, not till October. Okay. You heard what I said? Not till October. So you know what that means? Not till October. Okay. So <laughs> look at her face. <laughs> Bro, you just listen, listen. I did not plan for it. We did not plan for it, man. All right, but pick pick a fat or a juve or something. Come on. Come on. <sighs> Don't do that. <sighs> Watch okay. watch watch tear. Oh my god. <laughs> it's red. I know. You've I never know. been to a red. I know. Okay. I know. Look at you trying to sweet. Listen, find me a fat and you said juve? <laughs> yeah, I want to see what their juve is like. I haven't I don't remember hearing anything Ooh, about their juve. Atlanta and juve just sound like eee. Oh. Yeah, it's um, sound, <laughs> it sound kind of ghetto. Yeah, just a little bit. Heavy on the O. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm kind of frightened about it still. Um, Annie, if you listening to this, link us and tell us where you going and what you doing. I wonder if she performing. Please, please, please. Um, the twins keep sending me flyer after flyer after flyer. They're not sending mm-hmm. you events? They, they ain't sending me nothing. Ain't nobody include me. Loser. Mm-hmm. Nobody hit me up and let me know what was going on. <laughs> 
Um, where is the message she sent me? Is it in? See, I got too many damn Instagram accounts. I gotta figure out which account she sent it to. Oh my god! Do you, have, a, do you have like a ghost like one? Like a not a ghost one? Like a is that what they call them? A burner a one? Yes. A burner. A burner. Mm-hmm. Definitely have Girl, a burner Instagram. A ghost. Too. Girl, what the hell? <laughs> there is um a dollar fet. That's not actually a dollar because we're I not going to do dollar fets. Okay, and it's fifteen dollars. Last time a dollar fet was a dollar fet in Miami. Ended up being it was eighty dollars. Whenever I were reaching inside. And we were there for like over an hour, over two hours actually in line. Yeah, it was disgusting. Yeah, that was. But I feel like Miami do things different than Atlanta. I'm seeing that with certain events that travel. But mm-hmm. anyways, I went on the website, and even though the flyer says pay one dollar single dollar bill from any country before eleven p.m. Right, and I was like, I saw it on the website too. But I guess after eleven, it's fifteen dollars if you go in whatever. But I was like, okay, whatever. Which part that day? Um, Dollar Zone twenty six twenty Decatur. Decatur, where it's greater. Decatur, okay. where it's greater. <laughs> and then um, All Black Carnival with Stylo G Live is the next Mr. event. Touchdown. Huh? Touchdown in other him? Yeah. Stylo G. Yeah. Dumb. And music by Kevin Crown, Rico Suave, Negus Hold British, on, now. hold on, DJ now. Hold, DJ on. Finest. hold on. Bring it back. Wait a minute. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I hear New York DJs. Wait a minute. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we love that. Uh huh. Oh, yeah. really? Yep. Early bird ticket, $30, and it's from 10 to Early bird, honey. Early bird. Something said early bird, but you know, you damn Jamaicans. Oh, I don't um, forget. Oh, I forgot you like men sometimes. Sorry. I know Shirley bird. Man. Got you. Go ahead. Look at <laughs> Um, There's a Memorial Day ultra white day party also. Men are in other white day Listen, y'all party. Caribbean people. Who DJ in that one? Um, Minnesota and Pondelis. But you ain't going DJ. to that. That's for the Monday. Aren't you going to SSS? Yeah, it's a four p.m. to eleven. Um, oh. when is it? Um, when is SSS? Morning or night? Monday. I think it starts ten o'clock in the morning till about okay, six like or something. Okay, like the same, the same time. Yeah. Okay. It's the same Some of time. them are at night though, right? The ones that aren't cooler fets. So like the ah. um fatigue one, the army fatigue one. I think That's they do smart. in New York. That's smart. Is what you call it, and they have like a boat ride that I think they do in. Bitch, an SSS boat. <laughs> boat right? Listen, we're not dead. Boat turned over. No, man. Listen. Scary. Yeah. Miss oh, shit. Ride. There's our next mm. um Saturday. Reggae versus Soka is a cool effect. Hold on. Okay. Who playing at that one? Copper Ash, Negus British, Rigo Suave, Kevin Crown. What they charging for that one? What that one looking $30 like? $30 early bird tickets, $40 to $60 after. After what? After the early bird tickets, I'm done. Oh, I thought you meant like after a certain time. Okay. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> and there's a pool party, wet rehab. No, sir. May Mm-mm. 28th. No, ma'am. 2 p.m. to 9 p.m. Ain't getting nobody wet. It's too early for that. <laughs> for real. Like, kind of chilly. Yeah, yeah I'll wait. Mm-mm. Like a cold breeze lick me. I'm going to get sick again. No. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Okay. Um, there's a next party. Um, DJ Avalanche, Steely Bashment. Kevin Crown, Spooky the Boss. Avalanche from VI? Probably. Okay. Because they be coming in. Um, This one is in yeah. Lithonia. Yeah, they heavy, though. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they heavy out here. And then International Glow Rave. This is all from one account, though. So it's probably like a whole bunch of other stuff like going on. Like how they have on. a lineup. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And this one, International Glow Rave. We got glow sticks, LED lights. Um. It doesn't say. I like me a good playing. rave. Listen, <laughs> um, but yeah, Thursday to Monday, shall, a whole bunch. We will of events. talk and see what's going on. Yeah, we shall talk about it. Yeah, we. Because you want to give me a face like we've been talking about it. We ain't said nothing. So you only plan to go? Well, no, like on the side, like mm. full on conversation about it. I've seen side <laughs> the side conversations. I'm just saying. Oh. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm. Um. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just looking did, forward did to going out? to see Harry oh, Potter because did the gays come out for Atlanta Carnival or huh? 
do the gays come out? Do you know? Like I don't know. And I'm trying to find out, which is why I want to go to these something to see. Right. Well, that's how I met. Remember Brandon that right. I like fell in love with my first SSS red. He's from, yeah, the, yeah, he's half guy. Jamaican, half Asian. Mm-hmm. He's gay. And baby okay. was, yeah, I'm trying alone. to figure out what they're, what the gay scene Actually, I met like a couple, within, him and his friends were there. So yeah, I don't within know. the, uh-huh. you know, we gotta that's find the community. And yeah, that's so what I'm trying to see what the hell going on. I mean, I'm, down, I'm definitely Ooh. down to go Juve. I want to see. I'm yeah. I want to see. Mean, that's we, could, right. we could stick and move at G. Uh, we could stick and move at Juve. Mm. Tie up um, them sneakers. I ain't playing. Tuh. Listen, <laughs> listen. <laughs> it's whatever. But listen, I'm down. Maybe like a fat, like a cool fat, and then mm-hmm. Juve chill something. Yeah, I mean, if but, y'all going to Juve and y'all hearing this or something, like, let us know what's popping and let us know what isn't. Yeah, if y'all have Shit, been to let Juve, me they, let me know if y'all got a gay something Caribbean something, because possibly I don't know. Let me know. I'm gonna look into it. Um, yeah, and I don't even know where Juve is being kept. I gotta look that up too. I haven't looked up anything really. I just been seeing flyers that I'm like, uh, let's see. Right. I, I figure Carnival where there's Carnival, there's Juve, right? So they gotta have Juve. Have to, have to be so. Is it really carnival if they know Juve? That more I know too. But wow. the confusion about the two carnivals thing, um, Annie Love had one of the presidents um, for one of the bands or something, some, something they mean, uh, whatever. Mm-hmm. He was on her show last week and mm-hmm. he was talking about, you know, why there's two carnivals and blah, 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 and what the difference is between the two carnivals. I was like, oh, so it really is two carnivals. Like, See? One route takes like the city basically, and then one route is basically just like it's still in the city, but you're like, I guess it's a shorter route. I don't know, but um, it was it's basically funding. That's what the difference mm-hmm. is. It's basically funding connect, why they, they don't connect with each yeah, other. Yeah, they don't connect point? with each other at all. Which Mafasana, oh, Mawan, see the two of them. This is what I'm saying. I um, want to see what each one is carrying on like, with. Intersected or something. That would be dope as shit. Uh, okay. How the hell but, you? how do you do that yeah because one is downtown i think and one is on this side i think like in so, like it's a lot yeah you gotta drive if you drive and you have to go drop off yeah so park yeah so go yeah so uh-huh you kind of just but, gotta pick find out from people who've gone which yeah. one the best one which is one and then we stick there yeah because he was saying that the reason for the separation is that like the village versus the road basically okay so one is catering more to like the village, which is like the community and like, you know, community funding, et cetera, mm-hmm. et cetera. And one is more so concerned about the route and fetting and whatever, whatever. Gotcha. So I'm like, damn, those are two important things though. Y'all need to be together. Like be together though. Both of those things go together. Yeah. Like, and uh, they were together at one point, but you know, you give mm-hmm. people power and them go on like so them big and bad and them one take over things. I do. So yeah, they I'm separated. Sure putting down. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So Damn. that's basically what happened. The person that was president at the time tried to be like, I'm going to be president forever. We're not voting on anything else ever again. Like, no. Th- exactly. So people was like, mm, that's cute and all, but I'm going to go over here and start my own shit. Yeah, and, facts. Yeah. Damn. So that's what happened. But, you know, hopefully they bring it back together because I'm nosy. I really want to see what y'all talking yeah, about. Yeah, we want to like, go see everything. Exactly. You, even, you go one on me, go one on with FaceTime. I believe you guys are <laughs> stronger together. Exactly. So if anybody listening, y'all need to go ahead and put the group back together. Put the band back yes, together. Yes, get the band back together because Something. it's ridiculous. Um, um, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely down to check out and see what's going on. We're here yeah. now, so we might as well see Mm, oh, might as well on. indulge it start get hot and everything warm so how much SSS ticket again about $60 I know I think well I mean I thought it was one of the regular prices at this point regular <sighs> price for the last minute niggas I'll let you know I didn't <clears> even <throat> know that they dropped the tickets from last year cause I went on the website didn't it say Boxing Day yes I did see it had a Boxing Day special oh, so I was I like no class. Oh, okay see <laughs> I was like Boxing Day, like what? But what else may I keep? Yes, upon the list. I think that's all I had. That wasn't even on the list to talk about. But you know, um, you have nothing else you want to talk about? Um, me no. Y'all be safe. It's always y'all be safe. There's Literally. nothing else. 
<laughs> be safe. If for nothing week, else, make sure you and your people them safe. Check on your loved ones regularly. Don't do it just in case something bad is going to happen. Just do it because That's you it. genuinely fucking care. Right. I know as adults, we have our lives. And if we're not living with or directly involved with each other's lives on a regular basis, we sometimes lose track of like, you know, communicating with people friends family etc so like just take an extra 10 minutes out of your day and just be like hey boo how you doing like ten what's minutes. up God damn. like something just <laughs> like reach out even if it's take 10 minutes just to send three four ten text messages to people minutes. that you care about girl you got you know some people on your phone you can't talk to them they ask for 10 minutes yeah you, you might have to block them guys hey like, my, my friend, phone not like dead. talk to you in a few days how are you are you good friend okay, who me me all right you know they're upon the other side if Child. you want to know if you find me <laughs> okay now brother listen a <laughs> guys i'm gonna say oh okay that's what i was about to, that's what i was like who the hell who the song you? just sound nice okay <laughs> before y'all come for my neck <laughs> mm-hmm. but um but yeah honestly just like reach out to your people don't like you know whatever i know life happens shit people get caught up whatever but fuck it like say what's up um yeah like i mean if y'all feel like somebody out there you want to reach out to reach out to them it's crazy right now i mean don't make things happen be the only reason that you reach out to people even if like she said if you have not even 10 minutes give it them two minutes five minutes to Mm -hmm. if you can't call send a text thinking of you hope you good anything like that i mean oh shit that was loud yeah i mean you just yeah just stay linked in with your people stay prayed up stay linked in all of that stay um grounded protect yourself protect your friends all that all of that all of that all of that but um this seems to be the close of this episode um make sure you follow us on all the social media things facts we are streaming on pretty much all streaming platforms just about every goddamn thing Just, just about you know like I say on every episode, if we are not somewhere you want us to be, please let me know, and it will be in my best efforts to pause, get us there. Pause, pause. Um, I did want to see we we about to fly because I definitely told Auntie Joan because she didn't know about the podcast, so now she knows. And I was like, where? She was like, where are you guys on? I'm like, every goddamn thing. So if you got it, we on it. And yeah, we about to see how that's about to go. Big up Auntie Joan and y'all. Bye. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> so okay, funny you just said that, right? <laughs> because um next week i already know who my good gal of the week is next week and mm-hmm. it's a family member of mine and i'm gonna end up tagging her because you didn't have one for this week nobody was good this past week but i was saying the girl from the bathing suit something but you kind of okay. like no 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 you're right she deserves it damn yeah, yeah because her this is how i look now <laughs> you see you see that's how you feel keep your mind nigga <laughs> But yeah, um, House of Gem underscore. Follow her on Twitter and go support a Caribbean woman-owned, handmade. Right. Buy all her bathing like, suits and stuff yes. coming out of them. You know thing. what I'm saying? Hit her up if you need something that fits your belly. If, if your you belly not trunk, doing what I you want your belly it. to do, you feel me? But she don't do that. She so. might. You never know. Right, I'll, I'll tap in. I, she like, got I materials. I hope she don't listen to this and be like, "Oh, this girl's an asshole." It ain't nothing like that. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm sorry that happened to you, right? But yo, you know how we be out here. Get your things stamped and you Gucci. Yes that's all i mean i know it costs extra money i know it's you know it's an inconvenience in a way but if you think about it in the long run if you have your original drawings and everything make sure say something stamp speaking of business things i don't know how we just got back here but um i am thinking of doing um some other things with my time to acquire funds okay and um I'm sitting here like, man, that's part of the reason I moved to Georgia so that I can get my sure. shit like mm-hmm. popping. I want, I want more mm-hmm. money. I right. want more money with less things that feel like work. I'm not going right. to say with less work. I want to do more things that feel like my life rather life. than work. Mm-hmm. So I'm sitting there like I need to go, you know, incorporate because I'm incorporated in Florida. We are mm-hmm. incorporated in Florida. Mm-hmm. And I was like, I want to get it done in Georgia, blah, blah, blah. And I need to get whatever. I'm like, I need to get my EIN number. And I'm like, wait a minute. So I go on the website, the IRS website, and I'm like, I already did this. So mm-hmm. now wait there. Wait there. <laughs> I 
Listen, first of all, most of these vendor booths and things, when they ask you to like put in your information so you can be at pop-up shops and stuff like that, they ask for your mm-hmm. EIN number because Georgia ain't playing with y'all in this income, okay? They they tax you nationwide yeah, right on through. and right statewide. On through. Right on through. But you know, they, they also give you back state refund. So mm-hmm. that's true. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So they make sure that if you popping up, you got your little EIN number that you are an established business. So I was like, I can't do this because blah, blah, blah. No, baby. I just ain't remember that I got my shit together. My, exactly. my shit is together and I forgot. So that's if y'all nice see one. me at these little pop ups or whatever, come show <laughs> some support. Say what's up. Say hi. Um, I also put my stickers up somewhere for the first time ever. My barcode stickers for the crafts page. Mm-hmm. I was at this cool ass fucking restaurant over the weekend. Like dope as shit. And you're going to be like, that's so you. It looks like good vibes at what you call it. Ah. Outside with the lights and like, okay. it's an inside outside so vibe. Like but brick. of course, yeah. So that's what it was called. Brick. brick. So mm-hmm. it was like outside, but it's like grass and like, very me and i felt mm-hmm. like i was back in college while i was sitting out there and i was just like oh my gosh this and of course vibe. you go in the bathroom and there's like writing all over the doors and stickers oh my God, it's and like what you call it. yes so it's like a mixture of like gramps and yes so of course you know i put my sticker with my barcode so like you know people mm-hmm. can scan and get some ashtrays but i feel like they do like drugs at this place so i don't know okay. if they're gonna be buying no. weed <laughs> they might just listen. want psychedelics druggies need <laughs> maybe a little food. nose candy <laughs> I don't know. Note. well on that note <laughs> nose candy i gotta go because you know we i got rolling right. trays if you need to you know separate and line up your stuff man <laughs> whoa i don't uh, condone it but hey don't do drugs kids drugs are bad Crack is why the, <laughs> the only ones I do come out the damn flow, so it's yeah. okay. Come out the ground. I'm cool. Yeah, those are all natural things. Um, <laughs> whenever you're yes. ready, friend. <clears throat> Child, I told you I tried to hit a blunt the other day, and I didn't like how it made my nose feel. What you see, how you be, you know what? I'm logging off. I'm logging off because you're telling everybody all this business. <laughs> you didn't tell me, you didn't text me, I didn't get no text about it. Because and it I'm wasn't supposed nothing to be, great and I'm for supposed me. to be that person that you smoke with. But and you're nothing, not. I didn't smoke though. I just like did like one puff, and I was just like, hmm, like I didn't like the way my nose felt. That's one more than you done with me, right? So go ahead. <sighs> wow, that's great. Wow. <laughs> I feel sick. Okay. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You know, a lot of these little moments, and uh, this might be one that needs to go right oh, next to that other goodness, one. Oh, my goodness. No. Like, it might, I, you're pushing it. You're pushing it, friend. You're pushing it. <laughs> okay. So, I'm no. going to say, in my defense, I feel like I might have wasted the pull. So, so that doesn't you really like, count. You didn't like, the, like, when you pulled. Like, like I exhaled and like I didn't like the way my nose it came felt. out your nose. Okay, yeah, but I didn't like the way. But I do that with like blacks and hookah, and it's like whatever. But like mm-hmm. I don't know. Maybe it's the paper that they used. I don't know. I don't know if it's the weed. Maybe it's the paper. I don't know. But you know, maybe I don't. Know. But I ate an edible when I was yes, with you. You did. you did. You did eat the piece of the edible. <laughs> I was about to say. Let me take you out. Let me let you right. You ate me. Shit. You did eat peach. It's still not fair though because we were drinking. So, <laughs> so I don't know what I happened. I didn't really know what the hell and what I don't know. I, know. I was drinking then too, so I don't know if that affected me either. So see like, the hell I'm saying? see, it's not. I need to stop drinking, like, <laughs> like some tea or something. I would probably do that. I, the only thing I you feel can, like you I don't know. The shrooms, baby, you, you ain't no liquor in the world gonna mess with the shrooms. You gonna know the shrooms is the oh, shrooms. shit. Period. Mm. We are gonna talk about it <laughs> off <laughs> off air. We gonna talk about it because uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> make sure y'all support, you know, Facts. black folks doing their thing or whatever. Start with Pointless Creates. <laughs> Start with us and then go to PointlessTalks.com backslash crafts. Go buy an ashtray. Hit me up on the socials on Twitter and Instagram. Pointless Creates, the number eight. Um, I'm working on if my If you need a custom. Soon come. Soon come. You know, sugar production's coming soon. Soon come. Uh, soon come. <laughs> you might be able to see me mo. Listen yeah. to the podcast on Facts. all the streaming platforms. Get in touch with us on Twitter, Lion Young the for the general over there. So pointless lady. talks on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook. And if you want to link her on the Instagrams, it is them sugar underscore. Dem um, dem. 
And yeah, that's all we got for you. So just like everything else we do over here at Pointless Talks, Pointless Corner, Pointless Everything, whether you got <laughs> here, <laughs> Pointless Corner. <laughs> I like but, that. Because I literally do everything in this fucking corner. I like that. <laughs> I do like that. (laughs) Um, Whether you got here on purpose or by fate, thank you so, so much for listening to this episode of Pointless Talks. Peace out.